Hello, I just got a Combiner Wars Megatron and I want to share with you a modification of the joints that I came up with. Uh, the figure is very nice but as most of you know the ratchet joints have a very large steps between them so you're either stuck with this pose when everything is very far away or this one when the arms and legs are close together so mm, like you, this arm as you can see has this step but if you try to position it in this way it either snaps to this ratchet joint or this ratchet joint uh, this one has the modification made and as you can see it moves freely and also supports the same pose but you can position it in a more ne neutral way so to do this fix I used these things they are called rubber loops uh, they are used for uh, making bracelets I believe I don't have the original box or, or bag with me but I will provide a link down below so the way you fix you or modify this joint is there are two screw holes here that you need to unscrew I will do this now I will try to do as much as I can on the camera but it is hard to do I have tried this on a few other figures I will show you the results at the end of the video so right now the arm should the screws are off the arm should come off well maybe this one is not all the way out no. sometimes you need to force the, this by putting your finger here and there we go okay the way the joint works is that as you can see those grooves are ca ca being catched by this part here the brownish whitish part so when the arm spins this falls this falls into the groove so the way to modify it without damaging the figure is we are taking this part out you can do it with your hands but sometimes it's tight so I will do it with those pliers so you just catch this and pull it out now the arm here spins freely but you need something to to stiffen the joint and this is this joint here so what I do is I take this rubber band and wrap it around three times looks like this so it creates friction so when you put this back on it has a friction here so it doesn't slide freely and stays in place so now once you put this the rubber on, on the, in the correct place you need to put Megatron back together uh, sorry the correct way to put this is the other way around so this goes to the front and looks like this and looks like this it's the same thing but just from the other side so now we put the arm back in and we push this part so that it locks it's holding 
And now we need to get the screws back on. Make sure they are tight so that the part pushes to the, all the way back to the joint and the rubber creates sufficient friction. In some cases you may need to put two rubber bands. I think this one will be enough. I may need a different screwdriver. Okay, so the screws are all the way in. As you can see, both arms have a, a more smooth arm movement. And this arm probably will need two rubber bands. This one has one, but this one is heavier due to the cannon. So it hold, it's holding some of the poses, but not as securely as this one. Well, I think I will leave it as it is because that's the look that I'm going for. I, I'm trying to do the same thing with the legs. However, mm, if you unscrew this and this small screw here, those two parts appear to be glued. So if anyone knows a way to separate them, Please uh, tell me in the description, so me and other people watching this uh, can try it and do it by themselves. Uh, and other figure I did this to is Brainstorm. He has a similar problem with the joints. Here as you can see, the arms are moving smoothly this one again more than the other it sometimes depends on the way you position the rubber inside around the joint it's still holding some poses but it's not as secure uh, i think i did this one earlier so it may be just because it needs to settle inside of the joint same thing with the legs they are now the movement is very smooth uh, I try to do this with hot shot, but again, uh, some of his parts appear to be glued. So, and I do not know how to separate them. So here's the modification. I hope this video helps, and good luck with your customs. <laughs>